odds of uh -huh. being successful at Huntington Chili Fest back yes. this weekend. So fun. And I think it's going to be perfect for the kind of weather we have this mm -hmm. weekend. So yes. that is great. But here to talk all about it, we have Julie Childers and Megan Evans with the Ronald McDonald House yes. because there's a special connection between mm -hmm. that bowl of chili and what you all do at the Ronald McDonald House. So welcome. Yes. Thank, you. Thank you. Yes. So talk about that connection you all have because a lot of people that go because they know they're going to get to sample a lot of different types mm -hmm. of chilies, but there's an important reason behind it. Yes. So this year is the 40th anniversary of Chili Fest and um, Ron Smith, one of our long-term board members, mm -hmm. uh, puts it on. And so for the last 36, well, this will be the 36th year uh -huh. that the proceeds benefit the Ronald McDonald House. That's so wonderful. it's a great Great day to come down, get a bowl of chili. Um, there are different competitions going mm -hmm. on, Kids Corner for the kids, and all of the proceeds from the event come to benefit the Ronald McDonald House. Then how much do, do those proceeds, do you rely on those proceeds for the Ronald McDonald House oh, and what you guys do? This is our largest event of the year, wow. so we rely heavily on this. Um, it's usually upwards of seventy, seventy-five thousand dollars in <sighs> in proceeds great. for us. So. And through the years, we have raised through Chili Fest between the chili ticket sales and also the raffle sales, we've received over eight hundred and fifty-one thousand mm -hmm. dollars for our Ronald McDonald House. Yeah, great. So through the years, that is just mm -hmm. an amazing influx of revenue for us to be able yeah. to serve our guest families. And it's all about serving those families with really children is. who have mm -hmm. critical medical needs. They're yeah. coming to Huntington for that medical care. The families are able to stay directly next to. Right. Family Children's mm -hmm. Hospital. At no cost. Yeah, at no so. cost. And don't have to worry about the fact that it's expensive to, sit, to stay at a hotel mm -hmm. when they're there knowing that you know they may be there yeah. for weeks at a time. Yeah. And in some cases, months at yeah. a time. Mm -hmm. Yes. So this is going to help. Look at the little the faces Nine. there. The so that's our little that Izzy. Oh. oh. Is that you? That's me and Izzy, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah. Izzy has spent so much time in our house. Mm -hmm. She actually learned to ride a bicycle in our house. Yeah. Oh. So our guest mm -hmm. families become truly our families. Yeah. Uh -huh. We care about them. We care about what they're going through. Mm -hmm. And we're so excited to be able to provide that closeness to the hospital yep. so the families can focus on the child's medical yeah. well-being yes. and healing. That is so important. Yeah, let's talk about the tickets. Um, you have a raffle going on oh, for yes. a pretty good prize. Yes. <laughs> and then just the tickets in general for um, actually testing right. the chili. Okay, so we are so thankful for the generosity of Advantage Toyota. For many years, they've donated a vehicle for us to raffle. This year, David Ball and his team are donating a 2023 Toyota RAV4. It's an all-wheel drive hybrid wow. Woodland Edition. It's a really nice car. I was yeah. telling you guys, I go up there and I'm like, oh, it's a beautiful blue. It has the bronze uh -huh. uh, rims on the tires. It's a really, really nice car. And it's a hybrid. And a hybrid. And who yeah. doesn't that want a hybrid amazing. with gas prices right. the way that they keep Exactly. A lot of people up. are looking for that. So mm -hmm. someone is going to win that this yes. weekend. So they can purchase tickets from now until Friday at either the Ronald McDonald House or Advantage Toyota. They're $10 a piece. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, and then they'll be for sale all day through the event of Chili Fest and the winner will be drawn at the end of the event. At the end of the day. Mm -hmm. From the stage. Yep. At oh, Chili Fest and Ron will call the winner. Wow. Yes. Yes. Now, does, does the winner have to be there? No. no. Okay. No. Perfect. Oh. Yeah. Sometimes people come early in the day uh -huh. and people yep. like to get their right when right. it opens. Oh yeah. Okay. And talk about what time it does start. Pullman Square, downtown Huntington and those tickets to get those so the samples. chili tickets start selling at around 11 at 11 o'clock mm -hmm. they're a dollar a piece for about a three or four ounce sample of chili so you can check out all of the different um, tents and taste all of the different variations of chili for a dollar, and those are the proceeds that add up to come to the Ronald McDonald House. Yeah, yeah and I know um, sometimes people will come to the WSAZ booth. You see mm -hmm. the tent right there, and they're, they're like, okay, where do I get my tickets? And we're always pointing to uh -huh. your all's tent. Um, so remind everyone, what they should look for when they're wanting to buy tickets. Okay, so we have um, several different tent options uh -huh. uh, down closer to 8th Street and right at 9th Street. Um, there will be great big tents. We'll also be selling them at the beverage tent okay. this year, and we will be selling them at the Ronald McDonald House chili tent. Okay. as well. So there will be four different locations. We have banners to string out the top of the tents. Um, we have um, flag si uh, feather flag signs okay. that'll be up. So 
Yeah, and then just yeah. also everybody from the Ronald McDonald House will be wearing an, a red apron. If you see a red Ronald McDonald House apron, ask them and they will hook you up with You'll chili help. tickets. Exactly. Absolutely. And Susan here is going to be um, making some chili as well. Yes, okay. Taylor and I are going to see if we can um, uh, one-up Tim and Nicholas. <laughs> so the guys from First Look at Four against the gals on Studio 3. We did it last year. We did win. We're not sure how scientific it was or not hey, you know. because the boys ran out of chili and people kept <laughs> mm -hmm. voting so I'm not so lot. sure we made a lot of chili well, last know, you year you have to be prepared you do right. so. you do so. big <laughs> crowds at that event they do. we do yeah. so they ours do. is only for bragging rights ours is not for the big prizes like your really serious mm -hmm. competitors yes. at this event but we will be serving up our chili about one o'clock you know we got to work on it a little bit and cook it <laughs> so and we're all yeah. hoping the weather cooperates yes we've yes. been talking to our meteorologists fingers crossed yes. yes. it sounds like it'll be cooler yes so Perfect. the cool weather is perfect, perfect yeah, weather. Exactly. Mm -hmm. yes. yeah. And yeah. we just want to say thank you to WSAZ as yeah. well for being such a great partner with us in this fundraiser. It yeah. makes a big difference to our organization. We enjoy it. We, we, look we really do. to it every year. And we it's do. a fun event for the whole community. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Absolutely. I feel like the entire energy in downtown Huntington is very mm -hmm. uplifting and unique that day. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, best of luck. We'll thank see you, you Saturday. Yeah. All right. Thank we'll you so much. Thanks, we ladies. appreciate it.